Hey, how's everybody doing? It's Trip with Dad 007 uh, coming to you from the Magic Carpet Ride. Um, smoking another Grey Cliff because I have a big box and just drinking water tonight. Uh, trying to get rehydrated from the action that we just had. And uh, this is Hextrovert Ty. Uh, I am also rehydrating with water that is inside my Bilson's triple distilled vodka. Sarsbarella. <laughs> Triple distilled vodka sarsbarella. Well, technically, there is water in alcohol. Uh, sarsbarella is a uh, cowboy drink, but that, that's, that's, a, that's a cowboy thing. How do you get that in Australia? I don't know. I just drink it. <laughs> All right, buddy. That is definitely a cowboy drink right there. Um, okay. We would like to uh, start by thanking the community um, and uh, introducing a new timer. Uh, <laughs> this is kind of crazy. Here we go again. 40 days, 17 hours, 51 mi uh, uh, minutes, and 30 seconds. Mark now. Um, what a crazy uh, a couple of days that was. Uh, if you were on our Telegram when we were live streaming all the action, um, absolutely crazy. It was absolute bedlam, um, but super, super fun in a time that I will never, ever forget. Uh, a really, really fun, great group of people. What are your thoughts, Ty? Yeah, um, the vibe was amazing. The energy, um, the belief in what we're, we're doing, uh, which we've stated before. For all the uh, people, whether they're small or large, uh, bag holders, and um, it was a lot of fun. I, I think you went for about twenty-four hours nonstop, but probably with a lot more brain power involved than myself, um, with all the transactions and the DMs for communicating privately with people that were doing um, particular sacks from exchanges. Um, I myself had one and a half hours sleep in about forty. Um, but uh, the brain work was nowhere near as taxing uh, for me as it was for, for yourself. But uh, it was definitely a lot of fun. Um, and everyone in there was having a good old time. From one o'clock to five, uh, four o'clock the next day, a 20, 27 hour stint. We kept a, a voice chat running for that long. Uh, I can now uh, relate to Hexo a little bit when he said that uh, he, he did some 24-hour streams. Uh, we just did a 27-hour stint on live voice chat uh, with me sharing a screen. We had funds coming in from all over the world um, on a pool for Paul Sex um, that we expected to be um, – uh, maybe a, it was a close knit group of people um, that we opened up to the uh, to our uh, our channel uh, viewers, um, and, and that expanded, of course. And we expected it to be about three hundred grand or so. Um, it, it, it has blossomed uh, to uh, roughly three point three million dollars. Yeah, pretty, absolutely. pretty much. Yeah, pretty much vying for place twenty five right now on the leaderboard. And yeah. we know for a fact we've got more firepower coming in over the coming days. And we just want to let people know that it is still going. And we'll bring up some graphics to show you the bonding curve and our unofficial multiplier and what that means for you over the, the next 10 days or so. Um, but before we get into that, I just wanted to touch on something when Triple Dev was talking about funds coming in. And um, we do have a tip jar on our YouTube channel. And... Um, Someone, we believe it was a mistake and someone put a large sum of hex into that tip jar. Yes. We thought uh, we could we'd reach out to those people. Um, they would miss out on bonding curve um, uh, funds. So we decided to send that uh, money, uh, that hex from our tip jar back to our sack wallet and we, we sacked it because we believe after looking at their address and what they've done, they've actually sacked directly uh, to Richard Hart and Pulse X. And then I don't believe they were tipping us. I believe they were sacking with us for the multiplier because they sacked by themselves. Um, so 
if uh, you are someone who sent uh, 130,000 units of hex to us and you watch this video, please come and contact us. But uh, just know that um, once we found it, we moved it and we sacked it for you, bud. And if that and that if that was supposed to be a sack, and we realized that came in about a day and a half ago, um, uh, we we put it in today, and it was sacked um, on only the day one of the bonding curve. So if you take that into consideration, the price of hex a day and a half ago was uh, 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 lower than it was right now. Um, so, so actually on, on that, there's probably no harm, no foul. You're still getting the bonding curve. I mean, the, you're still getting the uh, multiplier. And I believe your hex was sacked today at a little bit higher rate than it, uh, than it would have been uh, a couple of days ago. So, so you're probably at a... Uh, uh, probably up. Yeah, probably up. Definitely not down. So uh, if that was a tip, you are too generous, sir. <laughs> that, that is absolutely bonkers. Um, in, my heart, in my heart of hearts, I don't believe it was a tip after investigating their their uh, their wallet address uh, purely because they were doing a solo um, sacrifice for PulseX direct. Um, and then we also went and investigated their wallet. They are a, a hex staker with a lot of hex and a, a beautiful staking ladder for the next 15 years, one of the best staking ladders I've ever seen. Um, so strategic, but um, with a lot of T-shares. But uh, after looking at the amount that that person did sack directly with PulseX, uh, we believe that it, it was a genuine sack to us, not a, not a tip. So uh, we've rectified that. Yeah, exactly. Um, let's go over a couple of things. Uh, we are... This is only counting ETH. I can't wait till how to post. Pulse has uh, the, theirs on because that's going to show uh, the real deal. Um, because uh, we have a, uh, a ton of uh, Binance Smart Chain contributions. Um, we are right, I'm right in this neighborhood right here. Um, yeah. Do you, I mean, people know our wallet address that have come into our thing. Do you do just point it out? Do you think we should? I don't see any harm in it. I don't, I, I'm an open book, man. We're at number 29. We end in DE807. Gotcha. And, if you take, and if you take the Ethereum sack there and combine it with our, um, our BSC sack, we are vying for spot 25 and we're real close. So whoever 25 is, we're coming for you, and then we're coming for 24, and so on. But um, absolutely unbelievable. Uh, thank you to the community. Um, we we, we uh, heard people mentioning uh, this sack room in, in a, a different uh, uh, voice chats. People were talking about, hey, they're talking about you over in voice chat. Um that is truly not our intention. We weren't sending people out and about to uh, round up business or anything like that. We were plenty busy, <laughs> busy with what we were doing. Uh, we, uh, but this thing just uh, blossomed. It was unbelievable. There's zero guerrilla marketing on our part. None, none at all. Um, what a great night, though. We, we, how many people did we have in our room? Uh, uh, at one stage there was probably 50 on the video voice chat 50 or 60 um it was held really well there was no talking over each other um we yeah it was it was awesome and it wasn't just talking about sack and leaderboards we we're talking about um other projects we're not going to show them right now but they'll come up in later videos but we, we talked about other projects community mem um community managers from other projects were in there that are sacking with us that we're talking about their up and coming uh, projects on the pulse chain it's going to be an exciting time yeah. and uh look at look at that leaderboard i mean that's just ethereum 868 million dollars uh richard's done it again yeah that, that that's insane um uh, but to think a a, a, a bunch of ra uh, ragtag bag holders that were sacking anywhere from a hundred dollars to a hundred and twenty nine thousand dollars uh could ban their their 
financial horsepower together and get uh, 28 wallets away from uh, Rakim uh, Rochelle. Um, absolutely bonkers, right? Who would have thought? Um, uh, that That's absolutely crazy. 28 wallets away from the top wallet. Um, unreal. No. That's it's, true. It's lower than that. We're, we're at 25. So 25. 20, 25. That's 24, because you've got him at, yeah, 25, 24, you're splitting hairs. We're closer. Yeah. Um, and our intention was, our expectation was not even to break a million. So we're truly uh, um, thankful for the people who believed in us and in our rooms. We've, we've had a lot of people helping in there. Uh, I want to give a big uh, shout out to um, Kelly Maverick. They have donated uh, to the tip jar uh to help pay for the combat for the next year for our channel. Um, and I believe another one of our internal members um, is uh, hooking up StreamYard for us. Um, we didn't ask them. It's just something they wanted to do. So again, we, uh, we really appreciate it. And if the, if the combat can be renamed, it's going to be renamed in your honor. Yeah. Thank you, Kelly. You're awesome. Amazing. Um let's talk about let's see let's talk about not that this if you take a look at this sheet it is um this is the the the, the um sacrifice points per dollar right um we we believe we have uh until the 22nd day of sacrifice so 12 more days uh and with our multiplier it's which is still, just, which unofficially is two right now yeah right around two um and if you take that into consideration uh, if our multiplier stays the same and uh somebody doesn't come above us and take up all the points right um with that uh, with that scenario, you can sack all the way to day 12 of, of this next this next phase and still get 10,000 points per dollar with our I think you, I think you mean another 10 days or so. We do have another graphic there from uh, one of our community members, Nicholas. Was it at 12 days that he said? Yeah, January. On, he based it on a 1.9x multiplier, so just took it down a little bit. Um, and he's got it shows the, the bonding curve and what it means. And, it, uh, and uh, January 22nd with us, you will still get a little over 10,000 coins per dollar with the multiplier. Pretty crazy. Um, so obviously, so, between the 22nd and now, uh, we're, we are still accepting contributions and, and because of the, the stress of uh, maintaining Hex and Ethereum and all that other uh, garbage uh, w w that was uh, extremely stressful <laughs> for the last 10 days, um, uh, it's calmed down quite a bit. So we've opened this up to people in Matic now as well. So right now we are doing... Uh, uh, of course, uh, hex and uh, stable coins on the Ethereum network, um, and, and we are doing stable coins and BNB on uh, the Binance Smart Chain, and we are doing uh, 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 stable coins and Matic on the Matic chain. Um, please take into consideration. And on Matic, it really does, and B and BSC, it really doesn't make sense for you guys to sacrifice it in Matic and BNB. Lock in your points or uh, lock in uh, your price and send it over in a stable coin. Uh, from this point forward, I was able to take time off of work uh, to to get all of this stuff handled, um, and. Uh, uh, I may be at work when that stuff peaks. So if you you would like to lock in your gains, send it over in stablecoin. That's my best recommendation for you. Otherwise, if you're going to do a, a moving asset, come in and, and, and contact us with Triplet there and we can either do it in real time or talk about a price range for you. 
Uh, but just be aware we, we aren't massive bag holders ourselves, so we still have uh, normal jobs at this point in time. We're hoping um, what Richard Hart has done is going to change that for us over the next couple of years. I believe he will. Um, but for now, yes, we still have jobs which we take the money from that jobs uh, to live and support our families and what is left over is literally pouring into Richard Hart products and projects. Exactly. Um, scheduling right now. Um, if it's a, a, a moving asset that's on Ethereum, let's just say hex or uh, Ethereum. If it's, a, if it's a large block, we'll sack it right away. Uh, and when I say large, it needs to make, uh, we do not, since we're paying for gas, we don't really want to take uh, uh, $50 out of the kitty to send you guys, uh, send your guys a sacks in. So we would rather just uh, accumulate right now and do a daily sack that's going to be around 3 to 3.30 um, and uh, let it fly. So that's what we're looking to do. We're covering the gas on all three chains. Um, if you would like to come in, and, and uh, join us, please do. Um, I don't know if we have anything else here. Um, do you have that chart from Nicholas? Did you not get that from our Telegram? This is this is the twenty fifth pin. Uh, no, it is. No, it's not. No, bud. <laughs> um, but going there right now. Can you open it up? No. Let me. I can't go in right now, bud. Really? Okay. Yeah. All right, well, we'll have to save that for the next video. But next video. Yeah, it's, a, it's a personalized one without um, bonding curve multiplier. Okay. So D-Bank, um, let's talk about D-Bank quickly. Yeah. Let's uh, refresh it, see if anything else has come in. So right now, this is what's going to be sacked tomorrow. Uh, on uh, a, It, it we, is luck because we drain the wallets uh, to the sack and... We start again. I think we just sacked like 30 grand, right? Uh, earlier today, a little over. Well, we did more than, yeah. Uh, I think we did 80 and then maybe another 30. I mean, it keeps trickling in. Yeah, it did. Yeah, that's right. We did do uh, another 80 and 30. So um, we're moving up still. Uh, and we still have a, uh, you could tell we're maybe a little bit fuzzy. <laughs> <laughs> what, what a wild couple of days. Um, it's been extremely wild. Yeah. Um, again, thanks for all of your guys' support. Um, I don't really have much left on this. Uh, uh, do you, yep. Ty? Um, just come join our, uh, our Telegram. The link will be... Um, in all of our videos, it's also in our about page. Um, from that Magic Carpet Ride room, you get access uh, via a link to the Magic Sack room if you want to be involved in the sack. We do daily AMAs. Sometimes we do hours at a time in the voice chat. You can come and ask us questions. There's moderators in there as well. We've added a few more. Um, and yeah, come and see what it's all about. Um, get a feel for it. We're happy to answer any questions. Everything with us is an open book. It's on chain. Um, just like when uh, whoever this uh, uh, anonymous person was, uh, we believe sent 130,000 units of hex to the wrong address. Um, we took it upon ourselves to take the high road and take that back out and put it in our sack address. Uh, if it was a tip, well, it's a win-win. It, it'll just, you know, but I doubt it was. And so we got you covered. Yeah, and for whoever who's trolling our, our YouTube uh, channel, um, troll that, okay? We, we had $30,000 worth of hex show up in our wallet in a tip jar, and we just sent it in. Troll that. Yeah. If you're watching us, we'll watch you. Troll that, bud. Yeah, yeah take the high road yourself. And not only analyze whether we're going to run off with the money, analyze what we just did. Yeah, exactly. Complete story. Yeah. And we're not forcing anyone or asking anyone to like, uh, you must sack with us. Like everyone, it's a, a freedom of choice, right? You want to be involved, be involved. You want to do it with someone else or do your own thing. That's awesome too, man. Yeah. Uh, we're just trying to uh, provide an opportunity, particularly for the small person, um, to get a 2X multiplier and give back it's it's pretty simple
Yeah, exactly. And, th- and this last little line is for, for Papa Bona. It's not rocket science. Yeah, it's not rocket surgery either. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's it. This is Extra Fair Ty signing off. This is Triplet Dad 007 uh, signing off from the Magic Carpet Ride. Thank you for all your support, everybody, and we'll see you in a couple days. You.